What up in this John's your boy IBS Kelso coming back with another MX Bikes banger and I'm here at Iron Man round 11 I'm on a 125 Husqvarna. Here's some uh, big boy bikes in here four strokes And I'm just gonna see if I can keep this thing wide open and at least get myself a podium here Thank you guys for clicking on the video. Be sure to hit that like button subscribe button. Happy Sunday I think the biggest thing I can ask for on this rough track is just consistency at the moment man There's like 45 people in here or something like that dude. Holy smokes. This gate is literally full <laughs> Lock her in. See if we can get a good start I can't believe I actually had this freaking inside gate. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I had that inside gate and it works. I'm gonna have to take this inside though, unfortunately. I didn't, I didn't feel comfortable with that. Nice. Good spot for me. Like somebody wanted to start a race. We're already in a race, baby. Up here with the forerunners. I'm battling this Kawasaki. Let's see what he's got for me. I gotta, I gotta choose the outside lines to keep up momentum. I have to choose the outside lines to keep up the momentum. So it's gonna be huge, baby. Nice, big boy jump. Unfortunately, I don't think I'm gonna be able to hit this cheese line. Not on no freaking 125, but. Should be able to get a good bounce. Man, a lot of bounces actually. Ah, uh, drop it. We're in top, we're in like top five right now, so that's huge. Yeah, I don't know what enticed me to wanna, I saw this lobby and I was like, you know what, there's a lot of people in there, it'd be fun to get this challenge going. Freaking 125 versus a whole bunch of freaking four strokes. And as you can see, they're gonna freaking be jumping off to the races, so it's nothing much I can do on that, but we gonna have high hopes, six minute plus two. Anything can happen. Big mistakes and catch up, easy peasy. There we go. Huge shout out to Deegan, man. After going 1-1, one, one, falling back, I mean like literally climbing from the back of the pack. And huge shout out to my boy Jet Lords, man. That was such a W ride, bro. I know a lot of people are hating on it, man. Like, oh, oh, he's not going to come back and crazy. You know what's crazy? I didn't hear not one person talk about Jet I mean, Chase Sexy yesterday. Respectfully. In a respectful manner. I hear nobody talk about freaking Chase Sexy yesterday. It was all about the Tomac and freaking Jet Lawrence show, man. That was absolutely insane. Everybody's talking about Chase Sexy this whole time. Why Jet's gone. As soon as that boy Jet comes back, no such thing. No talk in sight, bruh. Oh, no. Sorry, you know what? I'll, I'll take that. I'll fix that up for next lap. Fix up for next lap. We're not too off the pace. Like we're actually like maybe two or three seconds off from two four fifties up here. So biggest thing I can do is actually just hit my lines and stay consistent. We're kind of gonna be in the like this no man, like no no man zone, no land zone, whatever you want to call it. No man's land. Yeah, there we go. No man's land. We're gonna be like this no man's land at the moment. And then hopefully wishing for the best for someone to fall in front of us so we can get a battle, but I'm kind of already like seven to eight seconds ahead of whoever's behind me. So if they start getting super consistent and they're on a bigger bike, I can definitely see them start chasing me down. But we've got three, min three minutes to work with. And I'm not going to go too far off this jump. Okay. Unfortunately, I can't bring these freaking, I can't bring these scrubs back on a, on a 125. And I actually would have been a position right there. I actually would have been a position right there. I actually been able to catch number 69 here and Frank. Is it Anne Frank or is it Anna? I don't know. I think I saw Anne Frank or something like that. But I gotta be careful on my freaking uh definitely gotta be careful on my scrubs here. Apparently the two strokes not loving it. We'll be able to climb that up. Yes, sir. Looks like somebody DQ'd behind me as well. So that's on gives me a little bit more of a of a cushion to actually try to go fight against this person up here, which is still making mistakes as well. It looks like the leader's gonna go ahead and pass out of here. And I'm super excited for SMX, dude. I really uh, am hoping that the season starts up. Really excited to see it in uh, MX bikes wise. But uh, super also excited for the new OEMs to come. That was absolutely amazing testing those bikes out. They're still fun. It's like about making another video on them. I just, I don't know yet. I don't know if it's the hype yet. And uh, on top of that, I did test the eight kit bikes out. If you guys haven't checked out that video, dude, the eight kit bikes are absolutely insane. Really been enjoying that, uh, that Triumph 250, dude. That and the, Freaking Ducati, man. The Ducati's pretty nice. 
What's crazy is I didn't know those A kit bikes had preset freaking setups on them. So like you can literally like he already gave you a preset MX setup and a preset Supercross, and I was using default. I'm gonna have to go back on there and actually check those out, and maybe even make a video to like to see if like stocks better than the than the presets or something like that. I don't know. That was pretty sick. I didn't see that. So that's definitely something else I can actually work with and maybe make a video on. Just kind of give you guys ideas of what to come in the future, dude. Why does every time I get close to this dude, I literally mess up in stupid situations? Come on, freaking one two five, man. Don't fail me, dude. I at least get a second place. Dude, there's like 40 people in here, bro. I'm in, It's insane that on a 125, I'm up here in third place. <laughs> like, 40-something people in the gate, dude. Up here in third uh, in third place, dude. I can definitely catch whoever's in second, man. That'd be absolutely amazing. I think guy on a 450 is gone on the, whoever's in first place. Send it. Send it! I want, I want to jump up to freaking fifth place i mean fifth gear right there but i think i'd bog more than i'd actually help myself there we go that was huge oh, dude as soon as i get out of the rut man ah oh, dude these 125s man as soon as like i bounce out of the rut man it starts literally being wonky dude i was literally like one second behind the guy now i gotta fight all that time back again dude gosh that's the only sad sad part about it like Especially when you start being really competitive in the game at times. Just like simple mistakes that's like not even your fault. Just a Poboso physics is just absolutely absurd. I got literally connected in there and then all of a sudden I get bounced out of a rut for no reason. And it could be just because it's a stock suspension as well. So it could be on my own end. I can't really blame the game. But if there's one thing you can take from MX Bikes, it is never your fault. Just remember that. It is never your fault in MX Bikes. <laughs> so that guy's not too far. He's actually just now wrapping the corner coming on the straightaway. So... I still have a chance, and he's we're not even into last lap cheese yet, so realistically, I can stay up on this whole track, stay because I know he has like some parts in this track where he messes up, so if I can actually catch him here, that'd be amazing. So really just kind of focus on hitting my lines instead of going balls to the wall, and we might be able to have a good race here, and someone already goes down, so that could be him. That be, could be him. Just saw that yellow flag. No way we're in lap traffic yet, are we? Man, still more yellow flags. Oh no, someone's down in the freaking woods. Someone's just in the woods, bro, having a snack, bro. This ain't bonfire time, baby. Finding those lines, though. Capitalizing. E road's not that bad either. And we're still catching back up on him. Fourth gear. Ooh, there he is. There he is. Fourth gear. Nice. Good send. Do I go for the jump? I don't. Do I go for the jump? Can Whoa! 125 hitting the jump! Yo, 125 with the cheese! I did not expect this bike to be able to do that. I should have been doing that this whole time, bro. Oh, dude, I did not know that. Dude, that's a W. Oh, man, F this rut, bro. Freaking stupid rut, man. This downhill spot, too. I still got time, though. I'm still making it up on him. Still making it up. We just got to freaking connect in our ruts. Still got it. We just got to connect in our ruts, man. Yo, that was dope. I don't know if I can make this. Oh, stretch it. Nice. I'll take it for now. I'll take it, baby. Connect. There we go. All right, I'm 10 seconds off. I literally gained up so much speed again on this guy, and I keep freaking falling back. So it's going to be the huge, huge one. Last lap cheese, I believe, right? It's gotta be. I don't see no white flag though. Might not be white last lap cheese. Oh! Two to go maybe. So we definitely have time to beat him. We definitely have time to catch up on this guy. Let's go get him. I'm only like 11 or so seconds off. And he definitely has time that he is messing up. Man, if I would have stayed freaking absolutely wicked instead of following up on that rut, we'd have been straight. There we go. No yellow flags this time. I'm gonna take my outside spot instead of taking this inside. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. If you guys made it this far, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe button. I've been like really gratefully like appreciative for all the freaking support you guys have been showing me lately. So huge man. Ooh. Gotta love being staying singing on a 125. Stretch it. 
far as we're getting, baby. All right, I'm gonna definitely gonna go for the cheese again. Why not? I have to risk it for the biscuit because I'm starting to actually touch down here. I'm starting to get the crunch on. Oh my gosh! Can I stay in fifth gear? Actually, I wonder if fifth gear is gonna keep me up on this. Yes, sir. Big boy jump. I think he goes down. That's a, that's a position right there. He went down in the same spot. Please, please, please. Don't go down. Don't go down. I'll take it. I, I'll take it. I didn't go down. I'm going to go a little bit more outside here and connect there. There we go. So uh, it shaved a little bit of time off. Somebody's down again. I think that's the, I think that's the guy. I think that's a, I think that's a position right there. I can't lie. I can't lie. I think that's a position. I think he hears this Barker. Here's this 125 Barker. Uh-oh, we got a lapper. Here's this 125 Barker. Oh, no. We're messing up just a bit. No, oh, dude, bad run through the sand. Last lap cheese, though. Last lap cheese. Come on, baby. We're not too far off. Four seconds off, dude. Four seconds off, dude. Wait, did he go down? Where'd he go? Oh, I think he freaking left. He retired. I just saw him go back to the pits, bro. What just happened? I mean, I'm definitely getting gapped by the 450 in freaking first place, but... Ew, we stayed in it to the end, bruh. Can't we hold on to a second place for a podium position? Oh, my God. it has been a good W ride, actually. I got, Like I said, I mean, i kind of been in, like, no man's land the whole time, bro. Not really... Nobody's fighting or challenging me. I've been trying to make it back to that guy. And last lap cheese, dude. He gave up. Last lap cheese, and the dude gave up. Oh, save it, save it. Slow it down. I'll take that. Dang. That was a good battle, though. I mean, that was a good, like, fight to go get him. And then I, I'm kind of sad that he gave up. Would have been nice. Ugh! Nice, nice, nice. Go for the cheese again, dude. This line is perfect. 125 hitting that thing. Oh, my gosh. Yo, 125 is on X Games mode, dude. Nice. There we go. Nice. Finally being able to connect in that rut, man. That rut is so tricky to get in, dude. So rough to get in. Oh, oh, SpongeBob. SpongeBob. Let's go up to that fifth gear. I can be able to make it. Good scrub. Let's go. I'll take it, dude. Wide open against some freaking four strokes. Freaking 450 was consistent, and he was locked in, bro. Nothing much I can do on that one. This was a W race. Huge shout out to K9 up there. Sicko Mo, let's bring her in. I hit it with a little GG. I'll take it, baby. Thanks for watching, man. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe button. Thank you guys so much for the support. Pop, 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 p